Hi guys, it's May here. Welcome to my channel and welcome again to Cooking 101. For this Tuesday afternoon, we're going to bake. We're going to make puto leche flan. So for the ingredients for our leche flan for today, for the egg custard, I have here five egg yolks. One can of condensed milk and this is 380 grams. I have here some vanilla extract and for our butter, for our butter, B-A-T-T-E-R, <laughs> we have five egg whites, one and a half cups of all-purpose flour. This is two-thirds cups of white granulated sugar, one cup of water. And we'll be needing one tablespoon of the baking powder. In this area over here, I have my putu molds. And as you guys can see, I already uh, smudged it with butter. There you go. So let's start making our egg custard. Okay, friends, for our egg custard, again, we have five egg yolks here. And we're going to use this one can of uh, condensed sweetened milk so let's open this can and let's pour this one whole can into our bowl that we're going to add one tablespoon of vanilla extract okay so we need one tablespoon there you go and then we're going to give it a good mix if you guys have electric mixer, it's better to use. If not, then just use a whisker like this. And if you guys want to add um, food coloring on this, you can, which I'm going to do it right now. So friends, I'm going to use the clubhouse food coloring. This is the yellow color. So we're just going to put a little drops, probably two to three drops. One, two, three. All right. And let's give this one a good mix. It's just to enhance the color a little bit. There, just like that. So friends, I transfer our uh, egg custard here in this thing here so it's easy for me to um, pour it so this way it won't spill anything so I'm just filling it with just half like that so we have more space for the uh, for our puto or rice cake This way it's easier because I won't spill it all over. So I still have more left here. So I already did 15 of them. There. Two, four, six, seven there and then eight here. Okay, so now we're going to put it in a steamer. And we're going to steam it for 5 to 10 minutes. So let's put our puto. I mean the egg custard here. There you go. And let it steam for 5-10 minutes. And then we're going to cover it. As you guys see, I cover the, the lid with cloth. So this way, it will, absorb, it will absorb the moisture and it won't go to our puto. There. So that's how it looks like right now. There. Okay, so I'll show you guys the next step. So friends, I have my timer here, so we're going to start. 10 minutes, okay? And then while waiting for our uh, egg custard, we're going to do the butter. Okay, friends, for the butter, again, we have five um, egg whites here. And we're going to mix one and a half cups of flour, all-purpose flour. Oops, sorry. One 
and our two third cups of sugar. Let's mix this one up. Can you guys see? Okay. And we're going to add one tablespoon of baking powder. This one here. There. One tablespoon. And also we're going to add our one cup of water. Keep on mixing it. Mm. I think this is good, you guys. Yeah. So, this is going to be our butter for our puto. For our puto leche flan. Okay, friends, I already transferred it to our huge measuring cup in or 13 seconds left. And then I'll show you guys the next step. Okay, now it's finished. Let me check our custard. Okay, friends, this is our custard now. So I'm going to pour the butter on top of it. So let me show you. It's still hot. Okay, let's see. Oh, it's hot. Okay. So we're just going to pour this one on top. Just like that. Okay. Put it down. Number one. Can you guys see it? Okay. Put it on top. And we're going to put this one back to our steamer. And so we're going to steam this one for at least 15 to 20 minutes. And then I'll show you guys the finished product. Okay, friends, let's check our puto since it's the time is up. There. This is how our puto looks like now. Let me turn the light on so you guys can see it nice. There. Okay, so we're going to remove all this putu right now. And we're going to do the other one. So this is how our putu looks like right now. We're just going to uh, let it uh, cool off for about 10 to 15 minutes. And then I'll show you guys the finished product. Okay, friends, I started to remove one already. So I'll show you guys how it looks like when you flip it upside down. This is how it looks like right now. We have our leche plan here and then we have our puto here. So isn't it beautiful you guys, hey? So let's do let's do another one so you guys can see how I did it. So with this one I use a plastic knife. This is a disposable knife. Oh sorry, my uh wait, hold on. Uh, my alarm is done. Okay, friends, let's continue. So this is our puto. So all we have to do is pick the corners. You just have to do this one slowly. There you go. Just pick it and lift it up. Just to loosen the corners. After we loosen the corner, we just have to lift this one up on each side there slowly there and then you just fold it upside like this there so this is our 
photo let you plan there isn't that beautiful you guys hey very easy to do and yet very very yummy puto this is our finished product this is our puto flan or puto leche flan if you guys like this video please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and also if you haven't subscribed on my channel yet please don't forget to subscribe you guys thank you guys for watching and have a blessed day everyone and may the good lord bless us all let's try one okay Let's try this one here. This one here. Mmm. So good, you guys. Mmm. It's very yummy. Mmm. Thank you guys again for watching. Bye for now.